Good morning, uh, you are watching a uh, live uh, market outlook uh, for Tuesday 14th of uh, February 2012 uh, prepared by Windsor Brokers. The markets uh, came under pressure in the late uh, hours of yesterday and overnight <clears throat> after Moody's action uh, uh, of downgrading a number of uh, European uh, countries and the warning uh, UK, France and Austria over there AAA. Uh, AAA rating uh, turned the sentiment uh, lower in the most of the markets. Another uh, uh, rather ex unexpected uh, move of Bank of Japan uh, that uh, eases uh, policy further and uh, setting a new term uh, price goal, while Greece uh, faces now a tough job uh, to seal the rescue after uh, initially agreeing on the uh, main uh, uh, idea of the main uh, points of the current agreement in order to get the next tranche of 130 billion uh, euros and avoid the messy default. As a result of uh, Moody's action uh, late yesterday, the euro and the stocks as well as uh, uh, gold are significantly lower uh, during the night and uh, this morning as uh, single currency breaks some uh, uh, significant uh, supports and uh, ending up uh, lower after uh, uh, past uh, almost one month of uh, steady uptrend. Uh, most of the positive uh, tone was actually given on the uh, expectations of uh, uh, solving the Euro uh, Greece's uh, problem and uh, uh, the latest uh, decision of uh, Greece was already priced in the market so they expected the reversal and further easing uh, came uh, just at the end as the most of investors were uh, uh, buying rumors and uh, selling the facts, uh, keeping the euro in the near term uh, defensive. The similar situation is uh, with the cable that uh, uh, dipped uh, below 157 overnight, hitting uh, fresh lows at around 156.80 this morning, while uh, dollar yen continues to rally higher, uh, uh, breaking above its uh, past two days uh, congestion and uh, uh, testing uh, now the next uh, very strong resistance at 78.00. Uh, backed by Bank of Japan's decision, the Euro Swiss, uh, pardon, Dollar Swiss is uh, now again in the up move, uh, returning back to its uh, past uh, couple of days uh, range. However, some obstacles uh, to be cleared on the upside uh, to confirm. Otherwise, the risk would remain to the downside. The gold was also significantly lower, dipping to around 17.14 so far, just ahead of our. Uh, initial uh, support at 1700 zone while uh, crude oil uh, extended its gains uh, cleared the uh, $100 uh, dollars, uh, per barrel uh, barrier and uh, now attempting uh, through the main uh, uh, bear trend line. As uh, said the shares in Europe fell on Tuesday after uh, Moody's uh, warned it uh, could uh, downgrade the uh, top rated uh, sovereigns including uh, Great Britain uh, reminding investors that uh, Europe is still deeply in the debt crisis uh, despite Athens uh, steps to avoid a uh, disorderly default. Uh, the Bank of Japan has mentioned also uh, surprised markets by loosening uh, monetary policy further, boosting its uh, asset uh, buying and the lending scheme to add uh, more liquidity as it bowed to political pressure for uh, bolder action to beat uh, deflation and support uh, the economy. Uh, also full calendar uh, today, apart from the uh, re really already released uh, indicators uh, from uh, Japan uh, still to come at uh, 9.30 GMT is uh, UK, UK's uh, CPI uh, yearly reading uh, forecast for today is 3.6% uh, compared to 4.2% uh, previous uh, uh, month release <clears throat> while retail price, price index also on a yearly basis is forecasted at 4.1 again lower from the previous uh, release at 4.8%. Uh, uh, UK's uh, core CPI is forecasted at 2.7 versus the 3% of uh, the previous release. At uh, 10 o'clock GMT is uh, German zoo economic uh, sentiment that uh, is despite uh, neutral, uh, despite pardon, negative uh, reading uh, forecast for today is uh, minus 18, uh, pardon, minus 11.8 uh, compared to the minus 21.6 of the previous month. At the same time, Eurozone industrial production uh, monthly release uh, expected to decrease uh, by 1.1% uh, compared to a uh, previous release at minus 0.1%. Uh, European, uh, European uh, zoo economic sentiment also at the same time. 
it shows the expectation shows some improvement uh, minus 21.1 is uh, today compared to minus 32.5 of the previous uh, month release uh, across the ocean uh, starting with Canada's uh, new motor vehicle sales uh, 1330 GMT increased by 0.5 percent is seen uh, today uh, versus minus one percent of the previous one uh, retail sales uh, coming from U US at the same time uh, monthly retail sales are expected uh, to raise by 0.8 percent compared to 0.1 percent of the previous uh, uh, month uh, while the uh, core retail sales uh, again uh, monthly release at uh, expected at 0.6 percent compared to minus uh, 0.2 uh, previous release uh, US import prices are expected uh, to increase by 0.3 percent versus the previous release of minus 0.1 uh, percent at 1500 GMT US uh, business inventories uh, monthly release uh, increased by 0.4 percent uh, is uh, today's consensus compared to 0.3 percent of uh, the previous month release at uh, the same time at uh, 1500 uh, the Treasury Secretary Tim Gaithner will be uh, giving a speech uh, that's all from uh, today's uh, calendar now we're going to uh, take a detailed look in the markets and the technical points uh, to see what are the expectations uh, for today uh, starting uh, with euro as uh, usual as we can see the yesterday's failure to clear previous barrier at 132.80 where yesterday's uh, gains uh, stalled off uh, last Friday's low at 131.53 was the first signal of uh, poss possible uh, exhaustion of the pair as the upside was capped by 133.20.90 days uh, moving average as shown on the daily chart with the fresh weakness uh, emerging of uh, 132.80 and breaking below first of all uh, yesterday's low at uh, 132.00 fill the yesterday's uh, gap higher when the market opened uh, uh, with the gap and uh, also losing the uh, last Friday's low at 131.53 which is also the main uh, uh, bull trend line of the short term uptrend from uh, 126.22 uh, this was these were the signals of uh, further weakness of the pair as the price action extended lower to 131.26 so far uh, just ahead of our next uh, static support at uh, 131 and uh, 130 uh, 90 zone seen here with the possible extension down towards the very strong support at uh, 130 25 the higher platform of uh, beginning of February seen uh, as the next uh, target the near-term studies are negative however over uh, sold conditions uh, see scope for a uh, corrective action that is already uh, underway as the pair uh, bounces from its uh, today's low at 131.26 on the upside uh, 132.00 offers uh, initial barrier uh, with the 4 hour 20 days moving average at around uh, 132.30 which is equivalent to the previous uh, highs of uh, end of uh, January uh, would likely cap the upside for now uh, ahead of uh, further weakness only clear break about 132.80 is uh, would uh, signal uh, return to strength and uh, refocus 133 and uh, 133.20 uh, cable continues its uh, short term uh, downtrend of uh, 159.26 uh, where the 200 days moving average cap the uh, short term uptrend from uh, 152.33 low of uh, 13th of uh, January and currently is at uh, in the corrective action uh, moving lower uh, important uh, was a break below 20 days uh, daily moving average at uh, 157.12 as the pair uh, lost after yesterday's congestion under uh, main bear trend line at 158 uh, zone and the uh, uh, repeated uh, false break higher uh, that uh, triggered the fresh weakness a loss of uh, yesterday's uh, intraday low at 157.57 also filled the gap and uh, broke below 157.27 last Friday's uh, low uh, the important uh, 157.30 zone that was lost that's the higher platform and also the neckline of the head and shoulders pattern shown on the four hour chart that now might uh, confirm uh, that might uh, trigger a further significant uh, weakness of uh, the pair if a clear break uh, if losses uh, below 157.30 uh, 
uh, will be sustained. Uh, so far, the pair broke also 157. Uh, handle uh, hitting uh, 156.83 low so far with corrective action on oversold uh, hourly conditions now underway. Uh, 157.57 uh, the previous uh, low of uh, yesterday is uh, offering initial uh, resistance uh, while uh, 157. Uh, uh, 90 zone where is the main uh, bear trend line is expected uh, to limit uh, in order to uh, resume uh, lower. On the downside our immediate targets uh, are at 156, uh, 40, 50 lows of uh, 30th and uh, 27th of uh, January along with the 38 point Bonacci retracement at uh, 156, 62 day retracement of the whole up leg from uh, 152.33 up to 159.26. As mentioned, the dollar yen uh, uh, got additional boost from uh, Bank of Japan's overnight suction, uh, ending its uh, two days uh, congestion uh, within 78, uh, pardon, 77.50 uh, and 77.80, uh, with fresh rally uh, surging through main long-term uh, bear trend line drawn of uh, 2007 high at 124.14, and the uh, Currently attacking a uh, 200 days moving average at uh, 70, uh, 7803 with 7807 seen so far. So uh, we can say that uh, this uh, barrier was uh, briefly dented uh, so far. The scope uh, for further extension uh, is seen as the uh, short term studies uh, turned uh, positive. However, again, uh, overbought conditions on uh, hourly and four hour charts uh, suggest some. Uh, uh, pullback uh, would uh, precede the uh, fresh uh, action higher. Uh, previous uh, high and the uh, range ceiling at 77.80 offers initial support ahead of uh, dynamic one 77.58 what is uh, 20 days moving average currently standing while loss of uh, yesterday's low at uh, 77.35 also the range uh, floor and previous high at 77.20 would uh, soften the uh, short term uh, tone and uh, possibly keep the upside and 78 zone intact in case of uh, breaking below 77.35, 77.20. On the upside, the firm break above 78 opens next uh, very significant barrier at 78.27, a range of uh, November, December 2011 and the peak of uh, 25th of January 2012, a break of which is required uh, to open way for possible test of uh, October 2011 post intervention highs at 79 and 79.52. The dollar Swiss uh, recovered uh, the recent losses after a recovery attempt uh, from 91 uh, zone with the f actually after the false break below 991 zone when the uh, price hit 98.87 and quickly recovered the back. Uh, were capped at uh, 9200. Uh, renewed uh, weakness uh, found again support at uh, 91 uh, with the current uh, strong uh, rally uh, currently testing a uh, 92 zone. Uh, this signals the pair is uh, back to its uh, range uh, in past uh, two weeks uh, range with the uh, critical barriers at uh, 9250 range ceiling required uh, clearance of which is required to uh, signal some uh, stronger uh, recovery of the short-term downtrend uh, from a 96 uh, zone high, uh, high of uh, 9th of uh, January 2012. Uh, failure to break uh, 92.50.60 would signal further uh, range. However, the four-hour uh, studies now are uh, entering the positive uh, uh, territory with the renewed, uh, uh, with the fresh momentum uh, setting scope for a break above initial barrier that has been uh, briefly tested so far, but uh, we need to see the clear break in order to re-attract uh, 92.50.60 for possible uh, recovery higher. On the wider picture, the outlook is still in the negative uh, uh, territory as uh, 90 days uh, moving average continues to cap and uh, now coming uh, 20 days moving average at 92.02 uh, with break, firm break here uh, required to uh, improve the current uh, structure and open the next one uh, 93.13 is the 55 uh, days moving average. Uh, resumption of the broader downtrend from 95-93 uh, high uh, faces the initial support at uh, 91.00 and then uh, 90.75 Fibonacci 50% uh, 
retracement of uh, October 95-66 to January 95-93 rally. Uh, also, uh, we have the Chimoku daily, Chimoku cloud uh, base at uh, currently 90-93 offering uh, good support for now. Uh, as I said, the near-term structure remains positive and uh, sees potential of further extension higher while the wider picture is still in the negative territory and the uh, warns of possible uh, further extension of the downtrend from a uh, 95-93 high. A uh, quick look at uh, commodities. The gold is uh, on the back foot again. Uh, uh, continuing its uh, downtrend, uh, short-term downtrend from a uh, 1763 high of uh, 3rd of uh, February as uh, yesterday's uh, recovery failed uh, at uh, 1733 zone and the uh, fresh weakness is now underway triggered by uh, Moody's action uh, uh, extended losses set uh, towards uh, our uh, next very strong support at uh, 1700, 1704 is uh, low of uh, 10th of February. A break here would uh, signal further extension uh, of uh, the downtrend as the price action remains uh, entrenched within the bear channel of uh, 1763 high. A loss of uh, 1700 uh, would uh, open way for further uh, reverse, reversal of the latest uh, rally from uh, 1650, 25th of uh, January low with the Fibonacci 61% level currently standing at uh, 1692 seen as the next target in case of loss of uh, 1710 and uh, 1700. Uh, to avert immediate uh, downside, the end of the moment 1732 uh, previous high acquired. However, the negative uh, near-term uh, downside effort uh, for now. On the daily uh, outlook, uh, also the price action now attempting uh, to break 20 days uh, moving average that my uh, further weaken uh, uh, the current structure as the study started uh, pointing lower and uh, seeing potential of uh, attack and the uh, possible break below 1700 hour initial uh, support. The crude oil uh, regained the strength uh, after leaving a higher low at uh, 97.40 on the 10th of uh, February and clearance of uh, previous uh, highs at uh, 116, 100, 100 and 116 uh, are currently testing uh, the main obstacle, uh, main bear trend line drone of uh, 103.72 high, uh, currently standing at uh, 100. Uh, 76 uh, around 180 uh, with the break here and the clearance of uh, 101.20 next uh, barriers uh, seen uh, for a uh, further extension higher the studies are, are positive but uh, uh, quite stretched on the four hour uh, chart and uh, some corrective action might be seen ahead of a fresh attack uh, higher initial support at uh, 116 100 uh, where is uh, uh, the previous highs uh, while uh, 90 days uh, pardon 20 days moving average at 9961 uh, should uh, this area should contain the dips in order to resume the near term uptrend of uh, 9583 and the uh, 9543 lows good luck